You're listening to NPR. For Nebraska Public Media News, I'm William Padmore. Cowboys and cowgirls from... I have been listening to Nebraska Public Media since I was a very young girl. In the mornings, getting ready for school with my mother, we always had the radio on, and it was always tuned to NPR and Nebraska Public Media. As an adult, I listen to Nebraska Public Media on my way to and from school. It's kind of just my time to figure out what's going on in the world and have a clear head by the time I get into school. I like listening to Nebraska Public Media because it is fair and balanced news reporting. I also like it because it shines a light on some lesser known stories that I might not have heard about. I am a teacher by day and a rancher all the other times. I always tell people it is not an easy life, but it is a good life. I spend a lot of my time checking pastures, checking windmills, putting out salt and mineral, fixing fence, <laughs> the list goes on and on. There's always something to be done on the ranch. The Sand Hills are a really special place for a variety of reasons. Yes, obviously the landscape, but more than that, it's a community of people who are willing to help each other, people who are willing to celebrate your successes. This is a special way of life, and I am committed to preserving that way of life, but also taking us forward into the future. I may not be able to physically take my students all across the globe, even though that is a goal of mine. I can bring in global visitors right here to Taylor, Nebraska, population 190, and still give my students that global experience. Teaching is really where my heart is. My kids are always like, you're an NPR nerd, and I'm like, yeah, I am. It's Morning Edition from NPR News. I'm Steve Inst I am Megan Helberg from the Sand Hills of Loop County, and I watch, listen, and support Nebraska Public Media. The news is next.